the end of spring split, I think it was like week eight or nine. It was just one day before the match. I think we played splice that day. I realized I had Bell's palsy. So it's like a kind of a disease on your face where you can't move half of your face. So I couldn't really see properly. It was like a lot of, it was really blurry. On stage there's a lot of lights, so my eyes got dried really fast. And then uh, I was like rubbing my eyes for like pretty much the whole game. And uh, like two or three losses. I blame on myself because I couldn't really properly see my screen. And I think if I won one of these games, we could probably make playoffs, but uh, sadly we didn't. To my support. Good luck. But we should finish draft <laughs> for you to your support. Yeah. 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 Why are you so? I'll go TP, okay. Why I had my eyes on Miki for uh, for a while. He was always smurfing really hard in LC. I mean, like him and Hans had like some really bad weeks in Spring Split, I think. But they were also smurfing really hard some weeks. And I think in summer split, him and Hans were like the, by far the best botlin until I like crashed in the, in, in, at the end, you know. Also, I went to a Korean bootcamp with Misfits, uh, like Sankook, Miki, Hans, and Ofari. I was basically like watching Miki and Hans do a queue, and they were like, they were really, really good, and they were like so high rank. They were like almost like one KLP or something in Challengers, so I, I thought, oh, this guy is really, really fucking good, you know, I want to play with him. When I was contacted by G2 at first, it was just like an idea thrown out there. And I was actually really hyped for the idea because I really wanted to play with both caps and perks. And then if I can, get, if I can play with both in the same thing, that would be really insane. So I was pretty hyped for that. When we were talking about Luca playing AD, I had a few doubts, but after playing with him in like just solo queue and talking to him, he was really confident. And after playing with him as well in solo queue, I got a lot of confidence as well and I thought, to be really insane, and so far he's proving it. So, when I saw it, or like when I found out that Miki potentially could join our team, I was pretty excited. Also, because I knew that with Luca switching to AD carry, I knew that Miki could facilitate him in ways that maybe a lot of other supports can't. Last time I played with Miki, he was kind of our rookie because he joined like a bit later than we did, and he kind of had to learn the game a bit. And I feel like uh, Luca can help him in, in the aspects later in the game, on what like his visions on the game is, uh, where Miki can help him a bit more in the lane and like on his own role, yeah. <laughs> Who is eating donut right now? But I do not, you eat, are. do not eat it. Don't eat it. This son has to take it in, in the hand with me. Like, who has to eat it? Do you want to eat <laughs> it? What does mean? I don't want to take it in the hand with you. Okay, can we, we eat it? From one. Are you guys ready? Can someone eat it with me? Yes. I mean, not the same one, but like can we? Okay, well, I will just grab the first one then and enjoy it. Good job, guys. I will, so I will tell you we just do it. Just shut the fuck up and eat it. Mmm. We're all looking now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Imagine he bought them from Dunkin' Donuts. <laughs> <laughs> I just imagine a five minute chain goes, oh, it feels so bad now. It's Last super, time I ate Oreo so Donut, it was from like a supermarket and it was really dry. And this one is like not so dry and so nice and fluffy. Mickey fits pretty well because he's a bit of a quieter guy and the other four are very vocal, which means if he would also be the same vocal guy, then we would have, um, have clumsy communication. And he's the guy who like, doesn't need to talk much, everybody trusts him to see the engage. Uh, to follow him blindly and of course he's mechanically insanely gifted like everybody else so therefore he's a really good fit in the team. When I tilt, uh, he tells me, no, no, it's okay or let's play one more or you did fine or something like he reminds me of Trick in that way because Trick would uh, always tell me, always cheer me up 
and same when I do something very good in game, Miki like makes sure that I know that it's something good, so he like compliments me and like makes me feel special, you know. That's what Trick used to do, so I really like that uh, with Miki and it feels good to play both of them, yeah. That's just how it is. That's just how it is. <laughs> we're, we're just gonna be the new kings. <laughs> <laughs> it's settled up, okay? <laughs> no more kings. Every LEC team is a king. <laughs> All kings, new kings. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for bearing with us. We are loading onto the rift for XL taking on G2. Yeah, I'll change the camera. I'll change the camera. Yeah, yeah. There was Nocturne top side? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm leaving. The okay. final thing's up. Yeah, the Nocturne is all top, all top, all top. Alright. Just push me. Yeah, I, I will go to clear some wards, okay? You, you push me. I'll try and take your pool. No you flash for him. All yours are good. Wait. Galius does W. Galius does W. Take a lot of damage here, though. Take a lot of flash, okay? Maybe just push me. Push me, push me, okay? Are you fine? Cops? Uh, maybe. Maybe not. Nog is here, Nog is here, yeah, yeah. Look, 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 Nog is not there, Nog is not there, maybe you can kill Zaya. Okay. Oh shit! Cops! Nog is here, Nog is here, careful, Nog, no, no flash, Nog, no flash. We win, we win, we win, we win, we win. We can end after. Nog, 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 Oh. Hit, hit minions? Oh, oh, I was hitting as well. Yeah, and... Uh, I actually can you? Come on, hold on, guys. Hand plan. Hit, 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 hit. Oh, Nexus, oh. Nexus. <laughs> Holy fuck, Cops, you are so insane, actually. Like, you want to be mine so hard. My parents being able to go to Berlin and support me is obviously really great for me. Uh, they make me also strive towards winning more and motivate me because, I mean, when they're here, I don't want to let them down and like lose or, or anything like that. And they're just very supportive of them. And they also go to other events, like for example, we went to Korea or played finals or something like that. So that's great. It's it's always like a lot of very nice when you can see them in the crowd. Uh, I also know my mom is, is sitting watching at home and she was writing me that uh, both my aunt is there and my sister is there so uh, it's, it's nice to have them support me, it's nice to have them like be happy with what I'm doing right uh, and I can share the success I've had so far and the success I will hopefully keep having um, so it definitely feels good when they're watching. So, so, no more laws, no more peasants. I dream of Demacia, where every Demacian is a king. Yeah. <laughs> it's really I, good, yeah, actually. I, I, kind of, I kind of want to like listen to it again, you know? Honestly, yeah, I can you just do it again. Yeah, do it again. Please. Just do one quote. <laughs> but now I'm not feeling it. <laughs> can, you, can you actually do you know, any other quote from him or just this one? Uh, I mean, I know the respawn quote is like something like, uh, I've died more times in prison. This is nothing. <laughs> that's yeah. A good one. I think that's another one where I died in prison, but it's like, uh, where it's like the same or something like, I've seen worse in prison. There's like a bunch of prison yeah. quotes. Can go? we go? We can go, right? Yeah. Oh, he says, no more, no more cages. I'll double the <coughs> five mana. Hey, I'm getting Cartus Camps here. If you have a ward, Kill Camps is really good. If you uh, don't, I don't have a ward, I don't have a ward. Leona? Let me kill him. I'm finding a lot of ward. Capsule soon, maybe, by the way. Yeah. 
I mean, no, no, he's, he's still five. He's still five. Yeah, I think, I can I think. Can we die on this way? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Just base, base. Just 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 base. No flash, no flash, no, no flash. No. Oh wait, I died. We both have TP, okay, but I don't see Cyan. I don't see Cyan. Cyan, no ult, no flash, okay? Enough for the end. <laughs> I'll switch what? Yeah, nice. you can, you can. Good job. Maybe you push mid? Yeah. Mid? Oh, shit. Are we in? Are we in? Are we in? Yeah, uh, uh, both, both, both. Yeah, but it's fine, I can shield you, okay. dude. I should, shield I should, me, I can, please. Okay, now we're in. Let me get my GG. I'll have the free energy. Free energy? This kid is so lucky, I can come with it. No! No! Help me! Taking backstage now. Help me! Ouch! 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 Oh no! I didn't really win anything yet in LCS or LEC now. I think the closest I got was the finals, the first split I played. And I always thought like, if I made the finals in the first split that I played in, then it should only get better, you know. I should probably stay on top. But then it went downhill for the next two years. So now for this year, I'm really hopeful and pretty certain that we're gonna win a lot and be on the top. The future goals for this team would probably be to win everything. So including LEC and MSI and Worlds and everything. And just uh, enjoy our time doing it. Do you feel that's a realistic goal? Yeah, I think that's very realistic.